What's up, guys? Zach here with Dr. Eyeball MD. Today we're going to answer the question Can my cataract come back after cataract surgery? Let's get into it. So, cataract surgery actually involves removing the eye's natural lens. The eye has a lens similar to how a camera has a lens that helps to focus light rays onto the retina, which is responsible for seeing. As we get older, that lens tends to sclerose and harden and actually change colors, going from a clear color when we're young to a yellow and then a brown and even to a more white color uh, if we let it go long enough. And so if you live long enough, you will get a cataract at some point in your life. So cataract surgery is actually one of the fastest and safest surgeries done in the United States. The surgery itself is typically pretty quick, taking on the order of somewhere between 5 to 15 minutes uh, in an uncomplicated case. So your surgeon will remove your eye's natural lens and actually replace it with an acrylic lens or a lens made of a different material. That lens implant that goes inside the eye stays there for the rest of your life. But if you've had friends or know anybody that's had cataract surgery before, maybe they said that they had to go and have another procedure done in the office after their cataract surgery because it got blurry or maybe came back. What they're probably referring to is what's called a posterior capsular opacity. So when we do cataract surgery, the lens implant that we put in place of the eye's natural lens sits in what's called the capsular bag. Basically what that is is a small bag that holds the lens implant and that's where the eye's natural lens was beforehand. After cataract surgery, that bag that sits behind the lens implant can actually begin to opacify and become cloudy. And that's what we call the PCO, or posterior capsular opacification. But it's not actually the cataract coming back because that can't happen because you've already removed the lens from the eye. However, it can cause cloudy vision and it's something that we can treat. The way that we fix that is actually with a laser that's done in the clinic. That laser is called a YAG laser, Y-A-G. And what that does is it allows us to put a small amount of energy into that posterior capsular bag. And it actually allows us to break that bag open and it allows it to separate and you have a clear view through that bag because it's no longer in the way. There's different ways that it can actually be performed, but the surgeon will typically uh, sit you at the slit lamp, similar to when you have the eye exam, and we'll hold a lens against the eye or without a lens and you'll just sit there for about, takes about five minutes and the surgeon will actually open up that, pass, that uh, capsular opacity um, and it will, over the next few days, it'll tend to contract and move out of the way. It's a painless procedure, it's quick, it's in the office and it's something that's done routinely after cataract surgery. But again, the cataract itself has not come back, you've just developed a posterior capsular opacification after surgery. So if you or someone you know is about to have cataract surgery, and you're wondering if the cataract can come back, I hope this video helps and lets you know that it cannot come back once the lens has been removed, but you can develop a film behind the lens implant, the capsular opacity, which can be easily lasered away in the clinic. It's routinely done after cataract surgery. I hope you guys found this video informative and helpful. If you like the video, want to learn more about the eyes, or follow me on the journey through residency, fellowship, etc., subscribe to the channel, leave a like, and I'll see you guys next time.